people have been trying to understand why in some individuals the immune system is underactive and fails to protect us against infections and why in other individuals it becomes overactive and um, destroys our own organs and tissues leading to autoimmune diseases. We are really trying to do is understand disease mechanisms, what we call pathogenesis. As a researcher, I define myself as, as somebody that um, is very passionate about what I do and would like to make a difference and hopefully through my work and the discoveries of my team make life slightly better for people that are suffering from pretty debilitating disease. Technology has made a huge difference from the point of view that thanks to the human genome being sequenced and thanks to the development of uh, affordable and accessible deep sequencing technologies, we now can very easily know the entire genome of not just a mouse that might develop disease, but what we're doing now is going into the human patients that develop disease and starting to understand what are the precise mutations that cause disease. And it's only through understanding how disease comes about that we can start thinking about developing much needed targeted therapies. What excites me, um, it is the discovery. I mean, every day that a student from my lab comes and tells me about this piece of data that either was completely unexpected and serendipitous, or we had been hypothesizing for a long time and trying to prove, it is in any case extremely exciting. So it is those discoveries, breakthroughs, not just my excitement, but the excitement of my team, and the ultimate idea that we might be making a difference to people with debilitating diseases.